Hey, what's up everybody? Noresh here, welcoming you back into another video where today we are going to have a look into this car lock basic, a car tracking and alert system. This car lock basic system can be fitted on any vehicle, starting with your truck, car or motorbike. Now here we have some of the features, starting with the car tracking and alert system, works when you're sleeping actually without worrying knowing where is your vehicle and it got a real-time monitoring system easy to install that is a very good thing about it basically just to wire install it that's it it's got a multi-network sim card included which uh, roughly works on quite many places we will talk about this all in detail when i'll show you their website the way this car tracking system work is very simple come with the built-in sim card inside and also the built-in gps it will track its movement and update it all on the server. You get registered with the server, which is CarLock itself. Now, all the details for CarLock service will be available in the video description. And I will be also showing you in this video as well. Now, as usual, first we're going to see what comes with this CarLock basic system, following with the installation on our car and the demonstration. And by the end of this video, you will have an idea that is this device for you or not. So, let's get into it. Package includes user installation guide, activation card, mounting recommendation for the tracking system and and in last but not least the tracking system which is very easy and straightforward from the look of it. Now only thing which you need to do on this tracking system is connect these two wire straight on your battery and stick this tracking device in your car using this high adhesive peer pad. Now in the front of this tracker you also have a status indicator lights which are just right in here. They will illuminate when we are going to fit them and power it up. Now let's go ahead with the installation of the car lock GPS tracker system. I will be going a little bit fast forward in this space. But if you are missing any instruction, everything is available right in the packaging itself. We will show you how, to, how this whole system will be mounted. But let me give you a brief description before I go ahead with it. Now what I'm going to do actually, I'm going to install this tracker right on the top of the battery like this. This is a recommendation because the antenna gps antenna has to be facing upwards and you can also see the status indicator lights too then i'll be putting all these electrical cables right in there straightforward simple is that black to the black red to the red simple straight to the point now first i'm going to stick this gps tracker right in there by using this highly adhesive pad So there we go that's how easy and straightforward it is as soon power is connected and it's live all the time you're going to see status indicator lights right in, in front of it now if you would like to know what is the meaning of these both status indicator lights i would highly recommend you to follow the user installation guide it will tell you everything about it seems to be we are in a normal mode and it's time to activate this device now just before going ahead with installation of app you need to make sure that you should have this activation card with you which is very important because it will know everything about your device right in this card now let's go ahead and install the app on our mobile phone for this video i'll be using android mobile phone now on your android mobile phone open up google play store then in search option click and type in car lock and search for it now within the search result you should be able to locate an application called car lock by proteus technology click on it and click install once your application is successfully downloaded and installed open it right from there now once your application is open first time you need to click on to tap here to log in and activate your car lock device then scroll down and locate activate new device now right in here you need to go scroll down and read all the information if you want to and click accept 
now follow all five steps first you need to activate your device by using the activation card enter your activation code as well as the serial number and press next now once you successfully followed all five steps the app was asking for and activated your tracker you will be thrown onto the main screen of your app now let's quickly have a look into the app that what it offers now to start with as you can notice that the screen is red this means that the car was locked actually and it moved so it's going to show you where the car has been around exactly wherever it's been around it will just map up right on the map everything every location as you can see right in here now at the same time you can clear this up by pressing this exclamation mark and click on to this clear button now if you'd like to know in real time where car is standing at the moment of time if you press this car button which is down there it's going to straight away tell you where car is standing now to access the dashboard and the settings of your car click on to this dashboard button here to first start with is going to show you the logs within the log is going to show you each and everything what has been happening with the car when the trips were started when they were stopped when the vibration happened and everything like that in here now if you click on to the next option which is a smart lock now you can auto smart lock option which means that actually if you press this one it automatically lock the car lock is a position actually and they let you know actually kind of that's okay you can also schedule it as well on everyday basics too next one is the settings now here is the settings where what options you wanted to have in terms of vibration if somebody moves if your car moves it will get a detect a vibration and send you notification or you lost the gps signal or a gsm signal you send you the log and you get the option for the smart lock lock as well as well as the harsh braking now after settings we have the profile option as you might have noticed that i have got a two trackers actually one is on my bmw another one is on this honda jazz well somehow it didn't show me the name of the car but i can write it down no worries rename the vehicle okay i'm going to change it right in here to honda and the model is jazz okay now within the application it also give you information about upgrade to a standard plan and give you all the specification about a plan more detail is available right in front of you and it's only one pound a month not bad at all and if you look at that it's coming soon as well so if you are more interested in buying this kind of a product keep looking for this kind of option now we have looked around the app you can also access all the same feature on a desktop computer if you want to by using your internet browser let me show you how you're going to do that see open up your internet browser now within your internet browser type in the url which is https colon double slash my dot car lock dot co now in here type in the credentials the account which you created in the car lock app once you type in now the user interface on this website is very user friendly as well like an app which you've seen before now in here you got options of whatever cars you have added in there i've got a two cars i can see that i can select them either one of them will show you where they both are then down here you got a map and subscription if i click onto the subscription here is going to show you which car has got a subscription on at the moment i the new one which i added is got only 28 days left but i can go for a more subscription which is 82 pound or i can go with the basic one which is a 70 pound okay that's the one which i'll be going for anyways now there's another thing which you need to know about it that it offers what sort of set option it offers these all the options which you've seen before like a dashboard trip history notification as well as the settings of your car you can change them as well you can have the option of the sms notification or a push notification which is in the app actually now within the app you can get the options like vehicle moving device disconnected vibration and stuff like that 
or if you want a SMS to be sent to you in case yeah like a uh, option is here which can be enabled at the moment of time it's a disabled actually but you can enable it no problem the next option we have is the call which is also disabled but it's only available on to the paid full version once well so far so good it has been couple of days since I installed this car lock basic on my Honda Jazz and seems to be performing and recording all the data without any problem not seen a droppage in a signal or whatsoever previously I have owned another car lock product which is running on my BMW 520d and it's working great honestly speaking it keep bugs me for the harsh braking keep bugs me for acceleration and all these things because that's what I do on my BMW 520d it's a diesel car you have to rev it quite harder so it warns me quite a lot you know irritates me I have to turn them off actually but it works great but this basic one is also fantastic it is now available from amazon.co.uk I will also put a link in the video description for you guys so that's about it guys so thank you very much for watching this video if you still have any more questions please let me know in the comment section below